Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please name. O sacred feast, in, in which we partake of Christ, his sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled with his grace, and we receive the flesh of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food, and this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May your worship of the sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you want for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit. God, forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth, forth, we beseech you, O Lord, Lord, your grace into our hearts, that, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ, Christ your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may, by his passion and cross, be brought to the glory of his resurrection. Through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us meditate on the joyful mysteries. The first joyful mystery, the Annunciation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us to us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us to us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second joyful mystery, the visitation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, now and will be, forever. Amen. The third joyful mystery the birth of Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed, blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be, forever. Amen. The fifth joyful mystery, the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God, the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Holy Mother of God, pray for us. Holy Virgin of Virgins, pray for us. Mother of Christ, pray for us. Mother of the Church, pray for us. Mother of Mercy, pray for us. Mother of Divine Grace, pray for us. Mother of Hope, pray for us. Mother Most Pure, pray for us. Mother Most Chaste, pray for us. Mother Inviolate, pray for us. Mother Undefiled, pray for us. Mother Most Amiable, pray for us. Mother Most Admirable, pray for us. Mother of Good Counsel, pray for us. Mother of our Creator, pray for us. Mother of our Savior, 
Pray for us. Virgin Most Prudent. Pray for us. Virgin Most Venerable. Pray for us. Virgin Most Renowned. Pray for us. Virgin Most Powerful. Pray for us. Virgin Most Merciful. Pray for us. Virgin Most Faithful. Pray for us. Mirror of Justice. Pray for us. Seat of Wisdom. Pray for us. Cause of our joy. Pray for us. Spiritual Vessel. Pray for us. Vessel of Honor. Pray for us. Singular Vessel of Devotion. Pray for us. Mystical Rose. Pray for us. Tower of David. Pray for us. Tower of Ivory. Pray for us. House of Gold. Pray for us. Ark of the Covenant. Pray for us. Gate of Heaven. Pray for us. Morning Star. Pray for us. Health of the Sick. Pray for us. Refuge of Sinners. Pray for us. Solace of Migrants. Pray for us. Comforter of the Afflicted. Pray for us. Help of Christians. Pray for us. Queen of Angels. Pray for us. Queen of Patriarchs. Pray for us. Queen of Prophets. Pray for us. Queen of Apostles. Pray for us. Queen of Martyrs. Pray for us. Queen of Confessors. Pray for us. Queen of Virgins. Pray for us. Queen of All Saints. Pray for us. Queen conceived without original sin. Pray for us. Queen assumed into heaven. Pray for us. Queen of the Holy Rosary. Pray for us. Queen of Peace. Pray for us. Queen of the Family. Pray for us. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, pray for us. That we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, God whose only, only begotten Son, by his life, death, and, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant we beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He is clothed with a splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, we entrusted our Savior to the care of Saint Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve her Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee Prayer O God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this Jubilee of the Dominican Province of the Philippines. O God the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God the Holy Spirit, Advocate and Guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and words, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you, let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share with all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. Today, we celebrate the memorial of Saint Juan Macias, friar and religious. Juan Macias was born in Rivera in Estremadura, Spain in 1585 of a noble but impoverished family. Orphaned in an early childhood, Juan worked as a shepherd for his relatives an occupation which provided him time for prayer. Inspired by a vision, he left his native country and set sail for the Americas, arriving finally in Lima, Peru, 
where he, for a time, attended as chief of a wealthy Spaniard. In 1623, he decided to enter the order at the prior of St. Mary Magdalene in Lima, where he served as porter for 22 years. Like his friend Martin de Porres, he was known for his love and care for the poor and for his special devotion to the rosary. He died in September 16, 1645. We will now have the morning prayer of a church integrated with the Holy Mass. We invite you to please actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and, and my mouth shall declare, declare your praise. Come, let us worship Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. Come, let us worship Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. O God, be gracious and bless us, and let your face shed its light upon us. So will your ways be known upon earth, and all nations learn your saving help. Come, let us worship Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. Come, let us worship Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. Let the nations be glad and exult, for you rule the world with justice. With fairness you rule the peoples, you guide the nations on earth. Come, let us worship Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. Come, let us worship Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. The earth has yielded its fruit, for God our God has blessed us. May God still give us his blessing, till the ends of the earth revere him. Come, let us worship Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was, as it was in the beginning, now and will be, forever. Amen. Come, let us worship Christ the King, who raises up the lowly. sing to your name, Most High, and proclaim your mercy at daybreak. It is good to give thanks to the Lord, to make music to your name, O Most High, to proclaim your love in the morning and your truth in the watches of the night, on the ten-string lar and the lute, with the murmuring sound of the harp. Your deeds, O Lord, have made me glad. With the work of your hands I shout with joy. O Lord, how great are your works, how deep are your designs. The foolish man cannot know this, and the fool cannot understand. Though the wicked spring up like grass, and all who do evil thrive, they are doomed to be eternally destroyed. But you, Lord, are eternally on high. See how your enemies perish. 
all the worst of evil are scattered. To me, you give the wild ox strength. You anoint me with the purest oil. My eyes look in triumph on my foes. My ears heard gladly of their fall. The just will flourish like the palm tree and grow like a Lebanon cedar. Planted in the house of the Lord, they will flourish in the courts of our God, still bearing fruit when they are old, still full of sap, still green, to proclaim that the Lord is just. In Him, my rock, there is no wrong. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. I will create a new heart in you, and breathe into you a new spirit. I will take you away from among the nations, gather you from all the foreign lands, and bring you back to your own land. I will sprinkle clean water upon you, to cleanse you from all your impurities, and from all your idols I will cleanse you. I will give you a new heart, and place a new spirit within you, taking from your bodies your stony hearts, and giving you natural hearts. I will put my spirit within you, and make you live by my statutes, careful to observe my decrees. You shall live in the land I gave your fathers, and you shall be my people, and I will be your God. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. On the lips of children and infants, you have found perfect praise. Your majesty is praised above the heavens, on the lips of children and of babes. You have found praise to foil your enemy, to silence the foe and the rebel. When I see the heavens, the work of your hands, the moon and the stars which you arrange, what is man that you should keep him in mind, mortal man that you care for him? Yet you have made him little less than a god. With glory and honor you crown him. Give, give him power over the works of your hands. Put all things under his feet. All of them, sheep and cattle, yes, even the savage beasts, birds of the air and fish that make their way through the waters. How great is your name, O Lord our God, through all the earth. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be, forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. Just and merciful God, your love prompted our brother John Macias to become the servant of all. By his example and prayers, draw us into the mystery of your goodness so that we too may serve our sisters and brothers. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the first letter of St. Paul to Timothy. Beloved, I charge you before God, who gives life to all things, and before Christ Jesus, who gave testimony under Pontius Pilate, for the noble confession, to keep the commandment without strain or reproach until the appearance of our Lord Jesus Christ, that the blessed and only ruler will make manifest at the proper time. The King of kings and Lord of lords, who alone has immortality, who dwells in an approachable light, and whom no human being has seen or can see. To him be honor and eternal power. Amen. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Come with joy into the presence of the Lord. Come with joy into the presence of the Lord. Sing joyfully to the Lord, all you lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before Him, sing. Come before Him with joyful song. Come with joy into the presence of the Lord. Know that the Lord is God. He made us. His we are. His people, the flock He tends. Come with joy into the presence of the Lord. Enter His gates with thanksgiving, His courts with praise. 
give thanks to him, bless his name. Come with joy into the presence of the Lord. For he is good, the Lord whose kindness endures forever, and his faithfulness to all generations. Come with joy into the presence of the Lord. Please stand. Blessed are they who have kept the word with a generous heart and yield the harvest through perseverance. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory to you, O Lord. When a large crowd gathered with people from one town after another, journeying to Jesus, he spoke in a parable. A sower went out to sow his seed, and, he saw, and as he sowed, some seed fell on the path and, as, and was trampled, and the birds of the sky ate it up. Some seed fell on, on rocky ground, and when it grew, it withered for lack of moisture. Some seed fell among thorns, and the thorns grew with it and choked it. And some seed fell on good soil, and when it grew, it produced fruit a hundredfold. After saying this, he called out, Whoever has ears to hear ought to hear. Then his disciples asked him what the meaning of this parable might be. He answered, Knowledge of the mysteries of the kingdom of God has been granted to you, but to the rest they are made known through parables, so that they may look but not see, and hear but not understand. This is the meaning of the parable. The seed is the word of God. Those on the path are the ones who have heard, but the devil comes and takes away the word from their hearts, that they may not, be, that they may not believe and be saved. Those on rocky ground are the ones who, when they hear, receive the word with joy. But they have no root. They believe only for a time and fall away in time of temptation. And as for the seed that fell among thorns, they are the ones who have heard, but as they go along, they are choked by the anxieties and riches and pleasures of life, and they fail to produce mature fruit. But as for the, for the seed that fell on rich soil, they are the ones who, when they hear, have heard the word, embrace it with a generous and good heart and bear fruit through perseverance. My dear brothers and sisters, the gospel of the Lord. Praise you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat. The parable of the soul, isa sa mga, ito yung, isa sa mga parables na familiar sa atin. And actually, kung titignan natin, inexplain na rin ang ibig sabihin. The parable is all about growth parable. But in order for us to grow in our faith, and whatever it may be in relationships, whatever gifts or blessings that God may have given us, kasi dito, salita ng Diyos eh. Pwede kasi na ang binigay din sa atin, bibigyan ka ng Diyos ng bukasyon, ng grasya at kung ano paman. The challenge is always how to make it grow. Paano ito pagpapalaguin? Kaya nga, more than the word of God that tinatanggap natin, blessing at kung ano man yan, the gospel speaks about also growth. Paano pinapalago? At isa sa mga pwedeng gawin ay yung pakikinig. E paano nga ba ang makinig? sa relationship, sa pag-aaral, intellectual, psychological, o ano pa man. Isa sa mga hiningi sa atin ay yung makinig. 
at tunay na makinig. Isa sa mga challenges ngayon sa education, kahit saan po tayo, ay yung pakikinig. As high-tech as we are, pero may challenge din. Sa mga pag-aaral ngayon, madalas eh, kung mapapansin ninyo, halos lahat eh, nasa Zoom. Yung iba naman, module. Sa totoo lang, ngayon nga eh, matalinuhan ng parents. Kapag ang parents mo hindi ganun katalino, sorry ka na lang. Isa pa nga, sa technology yung tatawa natin na Zoom, Viber, kailangan may camera kasi hindi mo alam kung yung nasa kabila ba ay nakikinig sa'yo o tulog na. Naranasan ko po magbigay ng retreat sa isang grupo ng mga madre. Yun po ay kasagsagan ng tatawa natin ng COVID-19. Kasagsagan. Hindi pa masyado, pina, hindi pa na masyado alam ko ano yung technology na pwede. Facebook, messenger ka. Minsan hindi mo alam kung nakikinig sila o tulog na. But you know, whatever it may be, when you listen, kailangan din ang tinatawag natin na when you expect people to grow, kailangan din tinatawag natin na hope and that faith. Mahalagang ingredient para yung bagay-bagay na natanggap mo ay lalago sa iyo. Hanggat wala yan, yung pananampalataya sa kabutihan ng Diyos, sa kabutihan ng tao na nakikinig sa iyo, na kung ano man yung ibinigay mo ay lalago. Nakikinig ka. Kaya kami sa Zoom eh, papansin ninyo. Ang hirap kaya, you should have that faith that those people na nasa likod o kung nasa kung saan man sila na nakikinig sa klase mo. You just have that faith and that hope. Kasi hindi mo nakikita eh. Yung iba nagrarason pa kapag kaayaw na makinig. Biglang sasabihin, ma'am, wala na kaming signal. Whether it's true or not, you just have to believe. Sige na nga. Maaaring wala. Even in our own faith, even when we listen to the Word of God, we just have to have that faith and that hope na lalago ito sa buhay natin. Kaya yung pakikinig, requirement talaga yung hope at yung faith. Kasi pag wala yun, hindi lalago. Yung relationship mo, kahit ano pa man yan, you should always be willing to listen. But have that hope na yung pakikinig mo o yung pakikinig ng kapwa mo ay lalago. Kaya nga sa ibang hilang binasa natin na kung ano man yung binigay ng Diyos, dito sinabi eh, the seed is the word of God. And in order for us na lumago yung salita ng Diyos sa buhay natin, we should have that faith, that hope, and hopefully that love. Kasi ngayon, it is not just about the education of the mind. More than anything else, we should also learn how to educate the heart. Because it's the heart that truly listens. Ang puso talaga yung tunay na kikinig. Yung tinatawa natin na attitude, disposition. Kaya kahit gaano pa natin, kahit gaano ka, dami yung alam mo, hanggat hindi ka marunong makinig sa pamagitan ng puso mo. Hindi lalago yan. Disposition of the heart. Kaya nga yung good soil, hinahanda, ino-educate sa pamagitan ng pagmamahal. Lalago ang kabutihan ng Diyos. Lalago ang salita ng Diyos. Lalago ako anumang gusto mong lumago sa buhay ng tao kapag ka ito po'y dinidiligan ng pagmamahal. One time, naimbitan ako na magmisa sa kasal. Ako yung nagkasal, sabi sa akin. So, introduction po sa kanila eh, sikat pa noon yung may forever ba o wala. 
Sabi ko sa kanila, ano sa kopol, ba't kayo nagpakasal? Walang forever. Nakatingin sa akin yung kinakasal ko, pati yung mga magulang, ano ba naman tong paring ito? Kasi mula pa lang ng kasal, eh, negative na. Pero may karugtong. Unless you work it out. Anything in this world, even the Word of God, it may be so powerful, but if it is not, kapag hindi natin ito inaruga, inaruga, giniliga ng pagmamahal, hindi ito lalago. Kaya nga, very important that we receive the Word of God, when we listen to it, we should have that faith, that hope, and that love. Para ito po ilalago at mamunga ng marami. Tandaan po natin, more than the education of the mind, what is important nowadays is the education of the heart. The heart that is full of faith, full of hope, and full of love. Sigurado ako na lalago dyan ang salita ng Diyos. Let us all stand. Christ teaches us through the parables. Christ is the sower of the seed of, the, of God's word. Let us respond to his work by praying to the Father. For every petition we shall answer. Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That a church in the world may be like the rich soil, yielding a hundredfold harvest. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the leaders of our nation may govern in a way with the pleasing to God and to its citizens. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That unchecked ambitions and selfishness may never choke the word of God in our lives. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the sick may experience the healing power of Christ. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For Pope, the College of Bishops, parents, relatives, benefactors, and for all those who may promise to pray, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. For our missions and our brothers and ministry at Roma Biara Santo Dominicos in Indonesia, St. Dominic in Sri Lanka, St. Antoninus and General Santos and Davao, Kamigin and Kalayan, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. For the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. That those who have died may enjoy light, happiness, and peace in heaven, and may those burdened with grief be strengthened by God's word. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Heavenly Father, help us to recognize the seed of your word and at work in our lives. May we never get distracted by the cares of this world, but be active in your service and to produce an abundant harvest. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth, and work every man has to become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, 
fruit of the vine and work of human hands that become our spiritual thing. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours will be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and a good of all His holy church. Lord, on this feast of our brother John Macias, accept the gifts of your people. As we celebrate the love of your Son, may we grow in love for you and for our sisters and brothers. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, for you are praised in the company of your saints in, the crowning, of, in crowning their merits. You crown your own gifts. By the way of life, you offer us an example. By communion with them, you give us companionship. By their intercession, your sure support. So that, encouraged by so great a cloud of witnesses, we may run as victors in the race before us and win with them the imperishable crown of glory through Christ our Lord. And so, with the angels and archangels and the great multitude of saints, as we sing the hymn of your praise, Without end, we acclaim. Holy therefore these gifts we pray by sending down your spirit upon them like the twofold, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which shall be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Let us proclaim the mystery of our faith. Their 
for as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis our Pope, Socrates our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that to the Blessed Virgin Mary, the Mother of God, with the Blessed Apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may to be co-heirs to eternal life, and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through Him, and with Him, and in Him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil, graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and saved from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to the apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Now let offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. My dear brothers and sisters, behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are the called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Act of Spiritual Communion 
My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, humbly, spiritually into my heart, I embrace you as if you were already there, and unite myself fully to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. He stand. The love of God has been poured into our hearts through the Spirit dwelling within us. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to His people and set them free. He is raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of His servant David. Through His holy prophets, He promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare His way, to give His people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be, forever. Amen. The, the love of God, God has been poured into, into our hearts, hearts through the, the Spirit dwelling within us. us. Alleluia. Let us pray. Lord, on this feast of our brother John Macias, we have celebrated the sacrament of our salvation. May your grace be strength for us in the service of our people. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated for an announcement. Brothers and sisters, good morning. The Dominican community of the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag is pleased to inform you that the October Feast of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag will be on October 3, 2021, first Sunday of October. The Domina Masses will be scheduled at 6 a.m., 7.30 a.m., 9 a.m., 10.30 a.m., 12 noon, and 4.30 p.m. from September 24 to October 2, 2021. Additional Mass at 3 p.m. on September 26, Sunday. 
we invite you to participate in this Novena Masses and be one with us in expressing our devotion to Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. If you wish to sponsor one or several of the Novena Masses, you may fill out a form at the counters for Masses area and submit it with your donation and you will be given an acknowledgement receipt. Or you may visit our website at www.manawagminorbasilica.org at Online Pamisa, where you will find available online and other options for donation. All names of sponsors and donors of the Novena Masses will appear in the electronic souvenir program. Thank you very much for your continued support. God bless. Please stand. We shall now have the prayer for the blessing of the sick. God Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to a good health. Through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. We go in peace. Thanks be to God. In the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth, the Lord be with you and with your spirit. Let us pray. Almighty and merciful God, creator and preserver of the human race, giver of heavenly grace and lavish dispenser of eternal salvation, we humbly beg you in your immeasurable goodness to bless this vehicle carrying the image of the Lady of the Rosary in honor and praise of the Mother of your Son as it embarks today on its journey within the Archdiocese of Lingayen Dagupan. With your holy benediction, bless the place in which this vehicle will traverse, that the residents may be preserved from the pandemic caused by the enemies visible and invisible. Likewise, may all the faithful who venerate the image while meditating on the divine mysteries receive abundant grace, be delivered and be cured from all forms of illness and suffering of body and spirit. This we ask in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord be with you, and with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. Thank you. 